Hey guys, Shea Ali here coming to you from the red carpet of the 16th annual Indian Film Festival of Los Angeles at the opening night gala featuring the film In the Shadows. Tonight we're going to speak with a lot of the filmmakers involved on many of the projects at the festival. So let's go talk with them. Depesh, how does it feel to be at the festival? Well, it's very exciting. Uh, you know, I started films here, I used to live here, like I still live here. Uh, and bringing the back, uh, bringing the film back to the LA audience, uh, I'm really excited. Ah, oh, it's always great, you know, uh, because, you know, the, when you see so, so, so many people, you know, you know, really coming in to support independent films, you know, coming from India. And independent films are taking, you know, uh, you know, making some kind of place in, in in India and in the heart of the Indian audience, which is a great sign. But outside, when you see the celebration of these independent films and in independent uh, Indian moments, you know, you you are completely touched and humbled. Uh, the Indian Film Festival is a very good thing here out in Los Angeles, and especially for the Indians living here because it kind of keeps them. Uh, up to date with what's happening in India with all the new sort of millennial filmmakers and actors and everybody that has come into play and it's important to know what's happening uh, what kind of movies uh, people are liking in India I'm so happy that I'm a part of IFFL. I'm first time here in LA and uh, Prakashan is now going, uh, it's a lot of festivals. So it's happy to be the part of IFFL. This uh, film is called Take Off. It's about uh, the uh, 2014 Iraq crisis where you know a group of uh, 46 nurses got uh, rescued from the war torn Iraq. So this film deals with global terrorism, religion, about the struggling nurses, nursing community in India and the whole of uh, Indian diaspora who are working outside the country and how they earn for their families in, back in India. So, in that way it's very special. about a small little girl called Dhunu who dreams to own a guitar so and who considers herself as capable of, as a boy and how her unconventional uh, mother how she always supports her yes and what's the message that you want viewers to take away from your film from my film like it is possibility to dream whatever background you are from that's my message ask this expert that title alone it's so taboo. I mean, tell us a little about the film and, and what's it about? Sure, so the film is about a, a 94 year old Indian man who lives in Mumbai who is uh, giving sex advice through a newspaper column and, uh, and also through people who visit his house uh, for advice. Guys, how does it feel to have Hungry at the festival? It feels really amazing. This is our uh, US premiere and uh, we couldn't be more excited to have it uh, at this festival in the city. I mean, your cast is a list of great actors. I mean, how was that experience like directing and producing such talented Indian actors? That was amazing. I mean, I think they brought so much to the table just from the beginning. Uh, both uh, Nasir and Tiska read every single draft that we wrote and really gave their own input in terms of uh, developing their characters, the relationships and the story as a whole. Joshis and Hujas finally becoming what in business and life they always were. One family. I'm actually very excited because so far um, we've had our world premiere at Sundance, our open premiere at Clermont Ferrand in France and a bunch of festivals all across uh, America and Europe but this is the first time that like Indian audiences are going to get to see this film that's kind of been representing the country at a lot of festivals so I'm actually kind of nervous but also really excited um, that I'm finally going to get to show this film to my own country. This Indian Film Festival of LA has been such a dream full circle moment moment for me. I've lived in LA 10 years and I started at this festival as a volunteer so this is just nice to see some of my work 
being honored here. It's honoring. You know what? This is my first time being a juror for anything, and I am a filmophile, a cinephile, and I just look for a story that grabs me, a story that maybe surprises me, a story that warms my heart in some kind of way. Uh, there's a lot of different things I look for, and stories also that are important in this day and age to tell. We hope you guys enjoyed our coverage of the opening night here at the Indian Film Festival of Los Angeles. And come show your support as the festival runs through Sunday here at LA Live.